check. So you ran into a problem where um, your game won't run after you overclocked your card and it keeps on crashing on you and you're, you're frustrated. You're like, help me. So this is what you do. Um, this is very simple. It's very easy. First thing you want to do is you want to open up Afterburner, okay? Open up Afterburner. All right. You see your settings right now. Make sure it's applied. Apply it. And then open up GPU-Z. GPU-Z. Open up GPU-Z. Let that run. All right. You see that the overclock is applied. Okay. So once your overclock is applied and you have got everything ready, you want to, let's see what we're going to do now. You're going to turn off the overclock, okay? You're going to turn off the overclock to a your default setting. So let's just reset this one right here to my default, okay? You want to set it to your default settings and then minimize that. And then you want to run your game. So in this case, oops, Metro wasn't working for me, right? So where is it? Where is Steam? You want to run your game, okay? Go into your settings and turn up everything on your in your video settings in the game to maximum. You want to know the reason why you do this is because um some games the frame rate is locked uh, at a certain point, and um, if the game can't if if all of a sudden you say you play the game yesterday right or the day before you overclocked it and you're getting a certain amount of frames right and all of a sudden the game senses are like a huge boost in um, what, performance and you're getting way more frames per second. I don't know. I, that's, that's my theory. I think something happens there and it causes the game not to respond properly. So yeah, you turn off your overclock. You go into the game. Oh, in this case, Metro 2033. Um, I'll show you guys what I mean. So I'm going to um, close Camtasia and start recording with Fraps or DX Story. So see you guys in the game. I'll show you what I mean. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not surprised. Maximum. <laughs> Alright. You go back. All right, so now that you have went into, gone into your settings and turned everything up, you want to go back to where is it? And go back to Afterburner, okay? And then apply the overclock settings that you were trying to get to work for you. So in this case, that's the settings I was trying to get to work. So I'm gonna apply it. Don't check overclocking that startup, okay? All right. So then, um, let me check to see if this benchmark setting will work first with. Uh, Firmark and it seems to be working. So I'm gonna close up Firmark, minimize that, and we're gonna head over into the game and uh, start playing. Okay, so where is it? Uh, F10. Alright, guys, so we're back in Metro and yeah, overclock settings have been applied. We should be able to get into the game. Even if it brings me to see. Press any button to continue. Go back. It's me! Okay, so you wanna go to continue. Even though I suck at this game. That's <laughs> not for um it's only for demonstration purposes only. Not like hey you suck ass at this game. I'm gonna switch over to this shotgun because I think it's actually the barrel one. Okay. Should I no, forget it. Okay, so I'm gonna get killed right now. Ah. Okay, dead. That you should play at. So this is what I play at. And you want to go back. It should refresh your screen. 
and then go back to your video settings and resume the game. Okay? And so far, so good. You guys get the point, so I'll see you back on my desktop. <laughs> Quit the main menu. Okay. Fear the future. Fear the future. Alright, so back on your desktop after you've quit the game. And what you're gonna do, this is very stupid, I know, is you wanna run the game again. Again, to make sure that it works and your settings have locked on and the game recognizes your settings. And there we go, so we're gonna run the game again. Okay, guys, we're back in the game for the third time now, I think. Hopefully, it should work, because I'm testing it, it does work. Because it does work. YouTube! So, let's just wait for everything to load. I hope this bread burning guy doesn't pop up. There we go, I finally skipped him. Down, um, crash the game. Usually what happens is that every single time, my overclock setting is too high or the game doesn't recognize the settings, when I get to that cutscene with the guy typing, my name is bread burn, I was born in Russia, whatever it is, the game crashes when I try to skip it. So, Settings work, you guys can tell, and then we can go to continue. And let me go get my ass kicked by some enemy bots. And as usual, just say you're awesome in the comments if you don't want to do any of those. So, yeah, later, guys.